Peter Clark, Tesco Homegrown Manager of the Month in association with the Irish Daily Star. First of all, your reaction to getting that award? Actually, we're quite pleased getting getting the award. Actually, it's uh, it's all the work that was done in the league to date. So it's not it's not me. It's about the the squad behind us and the management team we currently have. This time last year they won Division Two. Now they're going for Division One. What's made all the improvement? Well, I think when we when we set start at the start of the year, we didn't know what to expect, and I think that we had kind of lower ambitions, if you like, just to stay in the league and, and see, because the squad is so young, except for kind of two or three players, the rest of the squad is quite is quite, quite, quite young. So as we progressed uh, every match, and I think what we have now is when we played Dublin, we played Monaghan, and now we've got Cork, so it's really where we want to be this time of the year going into a Connacht final, because we don't have a game after the league straight into a Connacht final, so in preparation for that, it's ideal preparation. So are you aiming just to have good preparation by playing Cork, or are you aiming to beat them? Anyone that knows me will tell you any team I go out against, I'm trying to beat. So, uh, but it's a massive, massive, uh, massive challenge. Um, to be fair, the girls are, are de- doing everything that, that, that we're asking of them at this point in time. So, yeah, we're, we're, we're looking forward to the match on Saturday. And Cora's on form as usual. Cora's on form at the moment. Yeah, she did a phenomenal day the last day where she kind of got all got all the scores. But uh, it's a team game, and uh, other other than a team is going to win this. And I hope that on, on Saturday that we, we show that we're 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 a, we're a team squad.